Hey, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rob Balasab. It's really glad to have you here. Today, I'm going to answer a, a question from our community today uh, about StreamYard. Uh, it was actually a comment here, so I'm going to share my screen here, and here we are. Um, and so the question here is from, uh, let's see, G Fancy Beauty. Uh, the question is on this video here that I uh, uploaded, uh, published a little while ago um, on a complete tutorial on StreamYard. Uh, I'll try and link that somewhere, but you can also just find this video uh, if you're like, hey, that's a good video to watch. Um, you can find that in my channel. It should be there. Uh, it should be either on my channel or, and also you can might maybe easier to find it in the StreamYard uh, tutorial playlist. All right. So the question here from G Fancy Beauty is, thank you so much for this video. I'm having a hard time on how to share a video uh, for a reaction video from YouTube. How do you bring in the video and start and stop play on in StreamYard? Um, and thank you for your time. All right, so really good question. Uh, thank you so much for that question. That's great. Um, I'm happy to share that with you guys. It's really uh, actually pretty straightforward. Once I show you, you're gonna be like, oh, that's all it is. Super easy uh, to be doing this, all right? So let me pull up. Um, actually, uh, before we begin, I wanna ask you uh, if you are new uh, to StreamYard, if you don't have a StreamYard account even, uh, and you're like, yep, uh, I wanna follow along this, actually want to try and test this out as well uh, you can go to the link in the description of video it'll take you to StreamYard. it is an affiliate link so you will be supporting this channel uh, by using that link if you decide to uh, continue on with a StreamYard paid account um, i've been using StreamYard for years now love StreamYard, love the platform um, they're they've been supportive of the channel over the years and just been really good friends with them i see them at conferences uh, we are we are we are really good friends <laughs> and so i love this platform they're just continuing to innovate all the time they've got new features uh, and really listen to their their community so um, go ahead check out StreamYard. there's a link in the description that will take you to StreamYard, and you can get a free trial uh, of StreamYard. All right. So um, if you want to check out more tutorials and how to get started with StreamYard, there's a playlist on my channel as well. Um, and you can definitely go and check that out. All right. So let's go back. Uh, now let's go to my StreamYard account. So this is my StreamYard account. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to just turn off my camera here. Okay. That way uh, you are not getting sort of this endless uh, void of uh, my my uh, my my photo, um, and so this is the Streamyard uh, Studio, okay? And so this is what you would be using, uh, G Fancy Beauty, um, if you are. By the way, shout out to her. This is her YouTube channel. Congratulations! Looks like you're about five and a half thousand subscribers. Uh, keep up the good work. Uh, yeah, it's awesome. So uh, shout out to you. All right. Um, so this is Streamyard. Now this is how you would share your screen and let's say it's a youtube channel so let's say um this is the the tutorial that i uh that this comment was left on um and say let's say you want to react to a youtube video now first things first you want to make sure that copyright you are doing things correctly and um, on par with copyright rules within youtube uh, but beyond that here is, is how you would share that all right so you go back to Streamyard in your dashboard Okay, uh, you'll see here that I'm sharing my camera, right? So that's why that's there. If I remove it, you got a blank slate. This is a blank slate here on StreamYard. I wanna add myself first. So I'm gonna add myself to the stage, okay? So this is my camera, there we go. Okay, so now I'm on stage, all right? Let me remove and add again, you'll see me there. So if I turn on the camera, see at the bottom here, it says start cam, I can do that and you can see me here. Okay, that's my camera right now. Um, all right, so now, You'll see this other uh, box here on the bottom. And this is my screen share, okay? So actually, let me let me close that. Let me stop sharing the screen. We got a blank slate here, okay? So at the bottom here, there's a present button. See this present? Present right here, okay? I'm gonna click on present. It's gonna say share screen. That's what we wanna do. We wanna share screen, okay? Share screen. We're gonna go to the tab that we like, which is my YouTube uh, video here. And the thing you want, and I'm gonna actually get my markers because this is really, really important, especially if you wanna share your screen and you wanna get the audio. There's a tab here that you may miss. It says also share audio tab. You see that? I'm pointing to it here. I'm trying to see if I can draw on this, but it won't let me, uh, of course. But uh, let me see here. No, it won't let me. 
uh, unfortunately won't let me draw but uh, yeah you you can share your audio tab here okay so you'll see this at the bottom of this pop-up there's a button that says share your also share tab audio if you can't find that let me know let me know in the comments okay I'm trying to zoom in here but I can't seem to zoom in uh, let me see if I nope won't let me zoom in but there is a little thing that says also share tab audio and you have to toggle that on there's a toggle here if you can see it here there's a toggle okay toggle that on that way when you play the YouTube video that you're sharing on screen then it also pulls the audio from the YouTube video okay if you of course want to react to it for example okay so now we click on share and again making sure that you have toggled also share tab audio okay now we click on share okay it's gonna go back to the original window that you're sharing which is the YouTube video that I showed you here in a second uh, a second ago so if I go back to my uh, my screen now, here we are. Okay, this is my YouTube, my Streamyard Studio. You'll see that now there is this little. This is the YouTube, my YouTube channel. Okay, the YouTube video that I'm sharing on this tab. Okay, now you see it here, and uh, and then it's gonna pull the audio. Okay, now it's gonna pull the audio. It's gonna pull the video. So if I play the video here, there you go. You'll see. That the video will start going okay you can see my face is moving and everything uh, it's going okay I'm gonna fast forward here so that you can kind of see me kind of scrolling through and you'll see that the video is moving oh great we're gonna get a, we're gonna get an ad um, but you can see that 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 is now being shared in my StreamYard studio so I can record that I can live stream that um, it's it works really really well Okay. It'll also play the audio and StreamYard will also capture the audio from the video. Okay. Does that make sense? Let me know if that makes sense in the comments. Just say yes, makes sense or yes, I got it. Uh, that way I know that it's connecting, that's landing. Um, but if not, be honest. Let me know in the comments too if you have any questions around that. That's really important. I want to make sure that that really uh, you guys really catch that all right so I'm gonna pause this here and that's really the answer to your question G fancy beauty that's the qu that's the answer to your question here on this comment and hopefully that helps you and hopefully helps others out there who want to share YouTube videos inside of StreamYard um, and you can use this whether it's a YouTube video it can also be um, videos from other sources um, you know might be an Instagram reel right um, you can use that as well as long as you are using that little little check little tab that I shared with you again um, where you share the audio okay share the tab audio okay so that's really the most important part so uh, with that hopefully that was helpful for you if you have any questions around this particular feature this use um, or if you have any questions around StreamYard in general just leave a comment down below in the comments um, you know that's what they're for I want you to ans ask all the questions there and I will make sure to answer them in a future video maybe even just answer them in the comments or point you to a video that's already here on my channel that will help you out all right again thank you so much for watching my name is Rob Balasabas check out one of these videos here that YouTube will pop up uh, on the screen uh, that it thinks that might be helpful to you. All right, see you in the next one. Take care.